So that was in March of 2017, when Chairman Schiff, as ranking member of HIPSI, was telling the public, the American public, that he had more than circumstantial evidence through his position on HIPSI that President Trump's campaign had colluded with Russia. Now, of course, the Mueller report, as Mr. Sekulow pointed out, after $32 million and over 500 search warrants, or roughly 500 search warrants, determined that there was no collusion, that that wasn't true. And I, I, we wanted to point these things out simply because for this reason. Chairman Schiff has made so much of the House's case about the credibility of interpretations that the House managers want to place on not hard evidence, just but on inferences. They want to tell you what President Trump thought. They want to tell you, don't believe what Zelensky said, we can tell you what Zelensky actually thought. Don't believe what the other Ukrainians actually said about not being pressured, we can tell you what they actually thought. That it is very relevant to know whether the assessments of evidence he's presented in the past are accurate. And we would submit that they have not been, and that that is relevant for your consideration. With that, I will yield to my colleague, Mr. Cipollone.